At Sofin's 2025, Airbus Helicopters showcased its extensive lineup of tactical unmanned aerial systems, UAS, including the Aliaka VTOL, VSR-700, Flex Rotor, and Kappa X, all designed to complement its manned helicopters in various operational scenarios. A key highlight was the introduction of the Flex Rotor, a versatile, compact vertical takeoff and landing, VTOL, UAS tailored for both land and maritime missions. The Flex Rotor stands out in Airbus's expanding UAS portfolio as a lightweight, deployable system ideal for long-duration operations. Weighing just 25 kilograms, this Group 2 tactical UAS offers a highly adaptable platform with a 2-meter body, a 3-meter wingspan, and a rotor diameter of 2.2 meters. Its 28 cubic centimeters two-stroke engine powers a payload capacity of 8 kilograms, enabling a mission endurance of 12 to 14 hours. With the ability to operate in confined spaces, including rugged terrain or aboard maritime platforms without dedicated flight decks, the Flex Rotor requires no specialized launch or recovery equipment, making it incredibly deployable in dynamic environments. Designed for rapid deployment, the Flex Rotor is particularly effective for a wide range of missions, including intelligence, surveillance, target acquisition, reconnaissance, ISTER, maritime surveillance, signal and electronic intelligence, SIGINT slash ELINT, search and rescue, and communication relay. Its operational versatility extends to various civilian applications such as firefighting, infrastructure monitoring, border security, and wildlife conservation, among others. The platform supports over 100 payload types, offering adaptability to meet specific mission needs, from infrared cameras to methane detectors. The integration of Aerovel, a US-based company that originally designed the Flex Rotor, into the Airbus fold further bolsters its UAS capabilities. Since the acquisition in May 2024, Airbus has solidified its position in the tactical UAS market, ensuring continued production and development from Aerovel's Bingen, Washington facility. The Flex Rotor complements existing systems like the VSR-700, especially for hybrid missions that integrate both manned and unmanned operations, MUMT. The acquisition aligns with Airbus's vision to enhance interoperability and expand its product offerings, reinforcing its commitment to advanced rotary wing platforms that can operate in conjunction with manned helicopters. The Flex Rotor has proven its worth in real-world scenarios, notably with the U.S. Department of Defense, where it has been deployed in high-threat, GPS-denied environments for maritime security exercises. The system's flexibility extends to forest fire monitoring, law enforcement support, and Arctic operations, where it has been used for navigation and surveillance. The platform's ability to launch from vessels such as the USS Paul Hamilton further highlights its adaptability in diverse operational settings. In addition to the flex rotor, Airbus is developing other unmanned systems, such as the VSR-700, which benefits from a collaboration with France's Defense Procurement Agency, DGA. This system is designed to carry out reconnaissance and intelligence missions and is already integrated with other technologies for enhanced operational efficiency, including radar from Jetta Marine and mission software from Naval Group. Manned unmanned teaming is a core component of Airbus's UAS development strategy. The increasing use of drones in conflict zones demonstrates their potential in hazardous and monotonous environments, allowing for improved situational awareness and reduced risk to personnel. To foster this integration, Airbus is working on projects like the Musher Initiative under the European Defence Fund, which aims to create a joint European manned unmanned teaming system. This collaborative effort is set to deliver new interoperability features by 2027, enhancing the flexibility and effectiveness of European defense forces. As Airbus continues to advance its UAS technologies, its vision for the future revolves around seamless integration between unmanned systems and its fleet of manned rotary wing aircraft. This holistic approach aims to create a more robust and flexible operational framework for the evolving needs of both military and civil aviation.